Great job on the last one. So here's another example for you to work on. We have three times the quantity four plus two times the quantity 11 squared minus one plus two times two, all minus three. So go ahead and pause your video and try and solve the problem. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look uh, after, you, after you've solved this problem, and uh, let's go ahead and solve it. So here we're going to start with parentheses, and within our parentheses we also have these brackets, and so we're going to look inside the brackets, inside the parentheses. So it's, it's a problem within a problem. And so we come here and we say uh, we have 11 squared minus 1 plus 2 times 2. So we do order of operations with that. So we start with our exponents and we do 11 times 11, which we know to be 121. Now, here we have we get to m drop everything down, which takes some time, but in the end, uh, it's worth it because it helps keep us organized and um, we can kind of go back through and just make sure that we're doing the right steps. So now that, we, now that we've done our exponents, we look for um, multiplication and division, which we have right here. So two times two is four, drop it all down. Right. and almost there. Now we're still inside of our parentheses, and now we do addition, subtraction uh, from left to right. So here we actually have subtraction first, so let's do that before we add. So 121 minus 1 is 120, and we leave that in parentheses, drop it all down. And there we go. Now we have, uh, to finish off these parentheses, 120 plus 4 is 124. And we drop down the 2. We keep our bracket. There we go. And drop this. All right, now we're done with our parentheses, and now we're in our brackets doing order of operations. So now, since this 2 is next to the parenthesis, it means that we multiply. So 124 times 2 is 8 or 2, 248. Let's put that bracket there. 4, 3, minus 13. Notice again how we're funneling down quite nicely. Still in our brackets, we do 4 plus uh, 248, which is 252. I'm going to keep this in brackets, uh, even though we're done with it in there, um, because the 3 next to the brackets means that we multiply. So now we come here, we don't have any exponents now, but we have multiplication and division. Multiplication and division, and so we take 252, and we multiply it by 3. So just a little side work, so we have 6, 3 times 5 is 15, carry the 1, three, 2 times 3 is 6, plus 1 is 7. So now we have 756 minus 13. We don't have any more multiplication and division, but we have our addition and subtraction. And so we do 756 minus 13, which over to the side we can show that. And so we have 3, 4, 7, so 743. We have come to the end of another video, and it's your time to choose. So if you got it right, click on I got it right, and it'll send you to another example uh, that you can work through. If you missed it, go ahead and click on I missed the problem. Uh, we'll, work th we'll work through another example, and then I'll give you another opportunity uh, to practice order of operations.